Okay, good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Okay. Throwback. Okay, welcome one more time to your Inglés Corporativo class. This is pre-intermediate pre one. Welcome one more time. Okay. Let's get started today with a quote, a motivational quote, a motivational phrase to start today. This quote says, don't limit your challenges, challenge your limits. Don't limit your challenges, challenge your limits. Can you repeat after me? Don't limit okay. your challenges. Don't limit your challenges. Don't limit your challenges. Challenges. Challenge, challenge your, your limits. limits. Challenge your limits. Your limits. Your limits. Okay. Challenge. Challenge. Mm -hmm. Okay, one more time. Don't limit your challenges. Don't limit, Don't limit your challenges. challenges. Challenge your limits. Challenge your limits. Okay. Uh, what is the meaning of challenges? Desafio. Desafios. Okay. Uh, no, that is changes. Changes. Changes is, is cambios. cambios. Challenges. Okay. Desafios. Retos. Mm -hmm. And challenge is a verb. What is what is the meaning of challenge here? In this pa uh, part is a verb. Uh -huh. Challenges, desafios. Challenge is an action. What is the action? Desafía. Desafía. Okay, desafiar. All right. So, this is a um, challenges is acting here as a noun. Es un sustantivo, un nombre. Challenge here is a verb. Okay. And uh, the same with the word limit. Not limit. In this case, limit. Desafía tus limits. Aha. But here, limit is a, a verb. Limit. No limit. Uh -huh. Exactly, and here is a noun. Okay. So, vean como las palabras cambian, un juego de palabras, okay? 
don't limit your challenges, challenge limits. Okay, repeat after me, please. Don't limit your challenges, challenge your limits. Don't limit your challenge, challenge your limits. Okay, one more time. Don't limit your challenges, challenge your limits. Don't limit your challenges, challenge your limits. Okay, very good, very good. Okay. So, if you have a challenge, no lo disminuyan. For example, you, you are studying English. What is your challenge? To communicate in English. Challenge. That is your challenge. Okay? Challenge. Don't limit that challenge. Okay? Don't say, oh, no, por lo menos ya aprendí a leerlo. No, no, no. Don't limit. Your challenge is to communicate in English. Not only read. No. Okay? So, challenge your limits. If you have difficulties, okay, we are going to overcome the limits. Si tenemos límites, vamos a superarlos. That's the idea. Okay? So, do it. Very good. Now, let's, con let's get started with the class. Just let me raise it. Picture, so Owens and let's get started with the class. Oh, I there there is an exercise we didn't finish yesterday. Okay. This exercise. Yesterday we started talking about the comparatives, so not. Uh, we finished with the conversation, yes. We finished with the conversation. Uh, so today we are going to study how to talk about preferences, comparing with adjectives, okay? Com making comparisons with adjectives there is a video here let me go to the video about preferences and comparisons okay um i'm going to mute your mix to play the video. Okay. Watch the video, please. You'll be able to comprehend and use comparative adjectives. Hi everyone, as I told you last class, we will talk about how to express preferences in English as well as to compare. Let's see. Preferences. Comparisons with adjectives. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. Which one do you like more? I like the leather one more. That one is cheaper than the wool one. This one is nicer than the wool one. The leather jacket is prettier than the wool one. It looks bigger than the wool one. It's more stylish than the wool one. Spelling. Cheap. Cheaper. Nice. Nicer. Pretty. Prettier. 
big, bigger. To express preferences in English, we may say, I prefer, I like. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. When we want to compare, we use the adjective in its comparative form. We use adjective plus er plus than. Small, smaller than. This dress is smaller than the other one. I recommend for you to study the adjectives in English in its comparative form, so you're able to compare anything you want. I also want you to work with this, cheap, old, and new. These are adjectives. Find out its comparative form and make comparative sentences using these three adjectives. Write them down in a discussion box. Preferences in English as well as to compare. Let's see. Preferences. Comparisons with adjectives. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. Which one do you like more? I like the leather one more. That one is cheaper than the wool one. This one is nicer than the wool one. The leather jacket is prettier than the wool one. It looks bigger than the wool one. It's more stylish than the wool one. Spelling. Cheap. Cheaper. Nice. Nicer. Pretty. Prettier. Big. Bigger. To express preferences in English, we may say, I prefer. I like. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. When we want to compare, we use the adjective in its comparative form. We use adjective plus er plus than. Small, smaller than. This dress is smaller than the other one. I recommend for you to study the adjectives in English in its comparative form, so you're able to compare anything you want. I also want you to work with this, cheap, old, and new. These are adjectives. Find out its comparative form and make comparative sentences using these three adjectives. Write them down in a discussion box. Okay, now let me show you. This one. Okay. okay, look at the sentences and the questions about comparison, okay? Um, I don't have to know. Yes, I have to pay the lawyer. How much Okay. Sorry, too much noise. The questions... Um, wh when you want to ask for preference, the question is this. Which one do you prefer? Okay, which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. I prefer the leather one. Or, which one do you like better? Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. I like the leather one better. Or, which one do you like more? Which one do you like more? I like the leather one more. I like the leather one more. Okay. And when you compare, that one is cheaper than the wool one. That one is cheaper than the wool one. 
This one is nicer than the wool one. This one is nicer than the wool one. The leather jacket is prettier than the wool one. The leather jacket is prettier than the wool one. It looks bigger than the wool one. It looks bigger than the wool one. It's more stylish than the wool one. It's more stylish than the wool one. So if you see the adjectives are on this. Cheap, nice, and pretty. These are adjectives, okay? Cheap, nice, pretty, big. Cheap, nice, pretty, big. And the comparative form is this, okay? Cheap, cheaper, nice, nicer, pretty, prettier, big, bigger. If you observe, um, in cheap, we only add ER. That's all we did. Only add ER. Cheap, cheaper. In nice, we only add R. Yeah, because we have the E. We have the E. So we only add the R. Nice, nicer. In pretty, we have Y here, so we change the Y for I. We change the, the Y for an I. And then we add ER. ER. Okay, pretty, prettier. Okay, adjectives with Y. We change the Y for I and add ER. And big, big, observe. We double the G. We double the G, big, bigger, okay? Uh, we do that when we have a combination. Let me show you this. Let me show you this, okay? For example, um, so big. Let me separate the letters a little bit more. Okay, so we have this combination. Let me write. This is consonant. This is vowel. And this is consonant. So when we have consonant, vowel, vocal, consonant, okay, we double the G, the last letter. Cuando al final del adjetivo tenemos esta combinación de De aquí para allá, o sea, de atrás para adelante. Consonant. Okay, let me write. Let me write here. So we have consonant. 
Consonant. Yeah. And here we have vowel. Cuando de atrás para adelante tenemos consonant, vowel, vowel, consonant, vamos a duplicar la última consonante. Ok. Well. Let me unmute your microphones. Ok, ¿alguna pregunta con esta explicación? People. No, teacher, but in the case with the word stylish, what happened with that? We don't have anything. No. That's different. Ok. That's different. Vamos a ver. There, there are other words like, like that, like stylish. Who's watching TV? Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, these are one syllable adjectives. Okay, all of this. Todos estos son los que llamamos one okay, syllable. Adjective. Adjective de una sílaba. Exceptuando los que terminan con Y. Ok. Ok. Because chip. No lo podemos separar. Es una sola sílaba. Pronunciarlo es una sola sílaba. Chip. Nice. También es una sola sílaba. Nice. Now, pay attention. When, with adjectives like stylish. Stylish. I'm going Stylish or elegant or intelligent. Okay. These adjectives have more than one syllable. For example, how many syllables are in stylish? Stylish two. Two syllables. In elegant. Elegant three. Three syllables. Uh -huh. Intelligent. Four. Yeah. Intelligent. Four syllables. Okay. So what is the comparative form? We are going to use another word, more. More. Mm -hmm. More or, stylish, more intelligent. Less, less okay. is like menos. Menos. Okay. More stylish than, more elegant than. More intelligent than or less stylish than, less elegant than, less intelligent than. 
But these are adjectives with more than one syllable. Más de una syllable. Okay. ¿Alguna pregunta aquí? No. Muy bien. Tenemos también, bueno, acá se nos presentó eh, la estructura, ¿verdad? Que siempre cuando estamos comparando, when we are comparing two people, two things, ok, vamos a usar that. Y en este caso se traduce que. Por ejemplo, this dress, this dress sí. is smaller than the other one. Este vestido es más pequeño que el otro. The than. Aquí se traduce que. No vamos a usar what. That. Than. <laughs> that. Okay. Then. Then. Bien. I have an exercise for you. This is a little bit simple. Then. Chop. Okay. Chop. Aquí tenemos algunas oraciones. To complete. Entonces, no está muy claro. Aquí está Di. Aquí está Di. Aquí está Di. Aquí está Di. Bueno, por ejemplo, uh, this is sharp. Entonces, voy a escribir acá. Y no Q. Sharp. Sharp. Mm -hmm. Fast, deep, young. Uh -huh. Sweet. Faster. Deeper. Younger. Sweet. Light. Sweeter. Uh -huh. Lighter. And Fine. Kinder. Warm. Warmer. So. Uh, ¿Cuántos estamos ahorita? Wow, well, yes, only 10. Ok, los voy a poner en grupos. Trabajen esas oraciones. And then we are going to check your work. Ok. Ok. Mateo, vení, vení, aquí estoy. Un dick. Uy, ese salió otro. Ok. Ahí está el ejercicio en WhatsApp también.
Yo, Kitty, I think I'm going to do the for me only strike, one strike, the other man. What I can ask him, we can put it in the mission. He might be the one who wants to work in the bar. I'm going to do it. 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 Okay. You finish? Yeah. Let's check. Uh, Margarita, can you read number one, please? A needle is shaper than nail. Night. Okay. Sharper. Sharper. Mm -hmm. Let me write it here. Sharper. Okay, good. Eunice, Teacher. number two, please. Okay, a car moves is faster than a snail? Yes, faster than a snail. Okay. What is a snail, people? I don't know. Snail? Yes. Caracol. Uh, Snail. Caracol. Okay. Y needle? What is needle? What is needle? Uh, needle. Aguja. Aguja. Okay, let's continue. Uh, it is, can you read number three? Please? Number three. An ocean is deeper than a puddle. Yes. Ocho, no sé por qué. Chicos, chicos, keep quiet. Ok. Hola. Number five. Number five, let's see. Iván, please. Okay, teacher, Timmy is younger than Daniel. Okay, very good. Younger. Younger. Okay. Ricardo, please, number six. Okay, five. Number five. Sungar is swing, swinger than Sol. Sweeter. 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 That sentence is very funny. <laughs> yeah. Okay, number six. Uh, Patricia. Señor Pinks, 
Miguel, number six. A fair than a rope. Okay. A feather is lighter. 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 Mm -hmm. Lighter. A ver, ¿dónde vamos? Efraín, number seven. Lisa is kinder than Georgie. Okay, very good. Kinder. 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 Okay. Um, Arely, number eight, please. Summer is warmer than winter. Warmer than winter. Warmer. 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 Okay. Dinora, number nine, please. Okay. Es, um, ahorita. Mm -hmm. Es, sa, Sam is kinder um, than gravel. Yes, finer. Than. Finer. Than. Finer. Than. Finer. Finer than gravel. Than gravel. And Gabby, number 10. English class is Later and uh, science class. Science class. Later. Okay. Okay. Very good. Very good. Now, let's practice, please. Sharper. Repeat. Sharper. 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 Faster. Faster, deeper, 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 younger, younger, younger sweeter, 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 lighter, lighter, kinder, 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 warmer, warmer, warmer finer, 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 later. 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 Let's continue. Repeat the sentence. And we're going to practice the sentence. A needle is sharper than a nail. Repeat. A needle, a needle, a needle is sharper than a nail. A car moves faster than a snail. A car moves faster than a nail. Than a nail. An ocean is deeper than a puddle. An ocean, ocean, ocean is deeper, deeper than, than a puddle. Timmy is younger than Daniel. Timmy is younger than Daniel. Sugar is sweeter than salt. Sugar, Sugar is sweeter, is sweeter than, than salt. A feather is lighter than a rock. A feather is lighter than a rock. Lisa is kinder than Georgie. Lisa is kinder than Georgie. Georgia. Summer is warmer than winter. 
Sand is finer than gravel. Sand is finer than gravel. English class is later than science class. English class is later than science class. Okay. Any question with this, people? No. Perfect. Okay. I have another one. Este se lo voy a dejar ahí en el WhatsApp para que lo trabajen en casa. Ok. Ahí les queda. Ahí está. You can do it at home. Very good. Así tienes que contestar más, ¿verdad? No, I am taller than my sister. Ya tienen que agregar más cositas. Por ejemplo, number two sería... Sara. Sara. Is this year than Mary? Is this year than Mary? Mary. Okay. Y aquí tienen las reglas. De nuevo. Okay. For example, they say adjectives with one oh. syllable add er or r plus then. Yeah, cold, colder. Yeah, one syllable only add er or r. Adjectives with two syllables that end in y, that termina in. Y, change Y to I, and add ER plus then. Happy, happier. Y or I. John is happier than David. Adjectives with two or more syllables add more plus than. Expensive. One, two, three syllables. Expensive. This book is more expensive than that book. Okay. Vean que aquí no cambia. No van a decir more expensive. -er. No, no, no. More expensive. The adjectives that end in a single vowel and consonant double the final letter before adding then. Lo dijimos, ¿verdad? Consonante, vocal, consonante. Double the consonant. Russia is bigger than Canada. Okay. Entonces, okay. eso es okay. lo que hacer acá. Acá incluso tenemos algo que eh, no les he mencionado todavía, pero hay algunos irregular adjectives. So, que so, o sea, porque son totalmente diferentes. Ok. Por ejemplo, vamos a ampliar esto para... Verlo mejor. Está muy algo pixeleado, pero este es good. Good 
El comparativo no es gooder. El comparativo better. es better. Better. Uh -huh. Bad, worse, far, farther, or further. Good is better. Bad is worse. Far is farther or further. Por eso se llaman irregulares, porque es totalmente diferente el comparativo. Y así hay algunos más. ¿Ok? Entonces aquí, por aquí están en el ejercicio para que los puedan colocar. ¿Any question with the exercise? No. No. Ahí les queda entonces en la plataforma ese ejercicio y lo revisamos mañana. Ok, yo creo que ya no nos da tiempo. One minute only for the conversation. Ok, people, we we'll finish with this. We we'll continue tomorrow. Complete the exercise. I'm right. going to check your work tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. okay. Have a good night. Thank you very much. Good See you night. tomorrow. Remember, we uh, have, you have to I'll finish see you tomorrow. the platform, then complete the, the exam for unit three. Yes, tomorrow like work. Okay. okay. Good night, people. See Good you night, tomorrow. Teacher. See ya. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow, Iris. Okay. Good night. Bye -bye. Good night. And dream in English. Good.